Hi everyone, John here. Today I want to talk about backing up your Lightroom presets. Now I receive a lot of emails from people uh, that have either changed their computer systems um, or they've had a crash of some sort and they need to have the presets they bought from me sent to them again, which we always you know, help them on do that. But the best thing to do uh, is have a system in place so that you don't lose all your presets that either you've created or you've bought or downloaded from other websites. Uh, so um, what I always recommend is having an automated system like Time Machine or Crash Plan, something like that's going to back up your system so that it's, you know, it's just not a manual process. However, in lieu of that, the second best thing you can do is actually go grab uh, the folder where your presets exist and back those up manually. So let me show you how to do that. Uh, we're going to come up to Lightroom right here and go to Preferences. And you're going to want to select the Preset tab and then select this right here where it says show Lightroom preset folder. This folder right here contains all of the templates and the presets for all of Lightroom. So the very best thing to do is just grab this folder labeled Lightroom and drag it onto a passport drive or into Dropbox. Um, that's the very best thing to do. Now if you generally don't use presets other than in the develop uh, module and develop presets that is, then all you really need to do is just grab the develop preset folder and um, that would be right here. And maybe you just use develop presets and maybe local adjustments brush presets. Then you'd grab this folder and the local adjustments uh, presets. However, if over time you've created a lot of presets um, for um, exporting or maybe templates for printing and all that, then like I said, the best policy is just grab the Lightroom folder uh, right here and uh, drag that over to a Dropbox or an external drive. So once again, as long as you have this folder backed up on a regular basis, you're going to have access uh, to your uh, presets. Now, once again, I know this may sound like the obvious, but clearly you need to drag this over to an external drive or Dropbox that's not on the machine where you may have problems. Uh, so don't drag it on your local drive just in case that drive fails. So I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to drop me an email at john at batdoorphotography.com. Thank you very much.